Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host, Dana, and my channel name is Only My Dreams. Thank you so much for coming by. I know it's been a while. It has been. I've been very sick, and um, now I'm getting a little bit better. So if I stop in between to take care of my throat, please be understanding. Now, in my community um, page, I just, I just um, posted up friend mail from Black Hawk. Amazing. Oh my gosh, for my birthday. I held on to all my stuff because I've been so sick and I'm just releasing my videos now for friend mail. So if you sent me something within the next week, you will see something from me. But in my community um, tab, you will see I posted some videos of when I vacuum sealed some cereals to extend the life that I had bought from the Dollar Tree. And um, I did another video doing a review of opening up something I had vacuum sealed and it was two years old, well past its Best Buy date, and letting you know, you know, what I experienced. So go check those out, okay? All right, let's get into this Dollar Tree haul. Um, the first thing, I'm so weird. I'm always really excited about <clears throat> the little, you know, just the normal stuff. It excites me. So when I saw the Scotty Tissues, 50% more, <laughs> Like I said, it's like the little stuff that gets me excited. 200 count, I picked up four. Because um, we use the tissue boxes here in the kitchen as regular napkins. It's just easier for us. And we've been sick and we've been going through them like no one's business. So there you have it. I got four of those. I did pick up some more of the Gildan underwear um, for my household. Because they still had some. These are a 2XL. So these would be for the Hubster. They had these two different kinds. So they had the briefs. And then they have them like in the shorts. Um, for $1.25. You cannot beat that. Because men's underwear costs a lot of money. It is not cheap. Not by any means. Then I was really excited to see. That they had the Comet back. Now this is the Comet. But they have two different kinds. This is the um, Foam Bath cleaner with bleach so this one foams up and it is a 24 fluid ounce now this is the comet all-purpose cleaner and this one is 24 fluid ounces so we have one that foams and one that's just like the bleach like the regular bleach so you know if you like the foam look for the foam if you just like the straight up liquid with bleach there you go it's available $1.25 if you happen to have a coupon, oh my gosh, even better, right? Even better for you. Then I was really happy to have found the Lara Bar. And uh, this is the one everybody's been sharing, the apple pie. Now, I wasn't too sure if I was going to like this. I'm going to be honest with you, you know. I'm not a granola type of girl unless I put it in my yogurt and things like that. You know, my husband's more of a granola person. I mean, I'll, I'll eat a granola bar and stuff. But, you know, this kind of cereal, I was like, uh, you guys, I opened this up and it tastes so good. <laughs> this tastes so good. So I did buy three all together. And if I find it again, I'll probably pick up two more because this is actually really good. And this goes for a lot more than $1.25. And it is a one pound, 4.7 ounce. So I highly recommend it. <clears throat> And I'm not that type of gal, gal that likes that kind of stuff. And I liked it. Then I did pick up a pack of the English muffins for $1.25. You can't beat it. It's actually cheaper than the cheapest one in Walmart. So, there you go. I now like them. And they taste good. Next, um, they finally brought back the Brush Buddies Herbal Toothpaste with charcoal. It's charcoal infused. This is gluten-free, paraben-free, fluoride-free, dye-free, naturally whitens and cold mint. Now, my husband likes to use this and so does a little day-day. And I haven't seen it in a very long time. So I bought some for the bathroom. I hadn't seen that for a very long time. Very, very different, very odd not to see that. Now, I also picked up, I know, I feel like I'm missing a bag. I think I am missing a bag. But I did pick up the Coca-Cola Lip Smackers. Okay. So I, I picked that one up. Then I did find the Ardell. 
and this one is called attitude adjuster and these are the FX drops so the FX drops for Ardell and it had two different colors so they had this really pretty gold and then this like really pretty bronzy color so I was like oh, I could play around with these you know for $1.25 why not easy way to try something new I know my sleeve keeps falling I hate that don't you hate that when it happens I hate that okay then I found something new and it's called the silicone bag light it says three super bright LEDs two light settings so you're supposed to put that in your purse and it says uh, easily attaches to a bag handle and um, <clears throat> I'm sorry guys I'm still getting over it let's check this out because I was like a bag light well you know I, in my in my and my thoughts were immediately I have some purses that are dark in the inside they're all pretty and bright in the outside you look inside there's a black lining it's hard to find anything and I thought about this so it does come like that and it has like this so you can attach it to something okay then I guess you press on it yeah it's a light and one flashes and one it is not super bright at all this is not super bright but if it was inside of a purse in the middle of the night I guess it would help but I wouldn't recommend get getting this because it's not bright bright it's not bright bright Eh, is a eh, type of a product okay not too terribly impressed by that one all right then in the what do you consider that the fourth of july section they had i only got two things so they had the foldable three foldable fans for a dollar 25 so you get three fans three foldable fans and I like to have a fan in my purse because I'm always sweating to death because I'm going through the change. So you get these kind of fans. So you just take the little clip off, boolea, and you have your paper fan. Then you clip that and it keeps it closed and you can fan yourself. So I thought that that was a nice little way to have a lightweight fan that's not going to take up a lot of space in my purse. And it feels almost like nothing amazing so I picked those up then the only other thing from the 4th of July section I picked up were these little um, wooden jars this says stars and stripes because I figured I could do some things with them and they're super cute yeah and you get so many of them it doesn't even tell you how many you get but it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You get twelve. Those are so cute. So I picked those up so I could do a project with them. Okay. Then in the crafts department, they had this two-piece metal tag, and it's really big compared to some of their other metal tags that are a little bit shorter, like they stop right here. This one is a lot bigger. And I thought that I can use this for my dollhouse miniatures and I could possibly use it as a headboard and cover it up with some fabric and what have you and use it like a headboard. Um, it would just save me some time and effort. So I got it for that purpose and you get two pieces in there. Then I did pick up another Westcott medium um, glittered green <laughs> favorite color scissors. Um, this this works great for layers of paper, fabric, or poster board. It is seven inches, and you see the glitter. Yeah, so I got another one because I really like these. And Westcott is a nice name brand. It is a very nice name brand. Now I did get one book. I got more to share with you. I did get one book, The Knit at Home hand knitted projects room by room and I know I am missing a bag because I have another book I have two books so I am missing a bag okay so I'll share it in the next video um so there you go so it's for knitters I am not a knitter but my sister knows how to knit and I figured you know I could show her this book and see if she wants it there
I thought that was really cool. They did have some other knitting books, really nice ones. But this is like the only one that I thought would make sense for her, for the purposes of, you know, her home. Then I did find the Be Pure Under Eye Jade Roller. And it looks like this. So it looks more like a stick. And then there's the jade. They had it in two different colors. So they had it in this real jade color. And then they had it like in a quartz clear type color. Yeah, so they have two different variations. Then I did get the Colgate Clean 3-Pack toothbrushes. Because we've been sick and we really do need to change our toothbrushes. Um, I got two satin eye masks. Okay, this one has... I want to say it has like the galaxy. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? It has like the galaxy look to it. And what I thought was interesting about these, let's talk about it. Yeah, because see, it's soft. It has like this really nice soft texture, like the little fur in the back. And it's nice and big. So yeah, I got that one. And I like the fact that it's nice and soft. And I got this one that is in the stars because my husband likes to keep the light on for a long time um, he works very long hours he works 12 to 14 hour days then he comes home and then he's watching his videos catching up with the news making his phone calls you know he's doing everything in the middle of the night <clears throat> and then I'm trying to go to sleep and he has a light on so I was like let me get these uh, so there you go and I thought they would be comfortable because they're nice and soft on that side so and that's the stars. Then um, everybody has been hauling the really cute cupcake wraps. And it is officially summer vacation time for my kids. Um, it was our last day. It was on Wednesday. And everybody has been showing the cupcake wraps for the girls. But I have little boys. So I got the dinosaurs. Everybody has been sharing the really cool ones that look like... Um, mermaids and what have you I was like I got boys yeah so I was glad I was able to find the little wraps that look like dinosaurs so that's gonna be fun now I thought I bought the pics for it I don't see the pics I thought I did it might be in that bag that I can't find but they did have pics so you could put the pics on top okay they do have it now <clears throat> Pookie's View shared her review on these. And I bought these already. And these are these little, you know, lippies by um, Be Pure Hydrating Lipstick Infused with Rose Oil. And she did a swatchy swatch. And this orangey, peachy looking one didn't have a lot of color payoff. But, you know, I had already bought it. So, you know. But it looks like that. And I don't have anything on my lips right now. So it's very moisturizing. Mm, that's what it looks like on the bottom. Okay, so that's this, this peachy looking color. That's this one. Now let me try this one on the top. It's very, it feels good, but it doesn't have a lot of color payoff you would have thought that it would have had more color you know when you look at the cap you would think oh look it's a really pretty really pretty color you know but you could definitely see it it's not like it's not there you could definitely see it now this one's a darker and oh it's much darker okay oh yeah mm-hmm you could definitely see that one. See the difference? Definitely see this one and not the other one so much. So let me see if I can. Mm. Would I buy it? Mm, it's not really my color. I don't really like this color. It's not really my color. Ugh, it doesn't look good. Well, I'm not wearing the right colors either, but you know what I'm saying, like the right clothes color. Would I buy them again? No. Do they feel okay? Yeah, they feel okay. But I wouldn't spend $1.25 on them. So if you can bypass it, bypass it. You don't need it. Trust me, you don't need it. 
All right, I did get one thing of Snickers, one thing of Twix. I did because I went shopping when I was hungry, which is a definite no-no. Then um, I did find the little bucket hats for my boys. So I did get two. There's two of them in here. They have a whole bunch of different colors and prints and variations for these little bucket hats, but they're great for the summer to protect yourself from the sun. And um, they're just great to have. So I did buy this for my boys. Then in the, what do you call it? The wedding aisle, the wedding department aisle. Uh, yeah. Yeah, the wedding department aisle. They have these really cool banners. Now, this is one banner that reminds me of what? That's right, you guys, Heidi Swap. It reminds me of Heidi Swap. And that's what it looks like. You don't have to put the letters on it, okay? Because the letters are separate. So you have this banner that you can create what? A photo album with. They have these kind of photo album books that you would buy and you would pay like, you know, 10, 12, sometimes 15, 20 dollars. And now you can get them for $1.25 and create your own little book that looks like this. I have one already that I have bought and I had used and made it look really cool. Um, so when I saw these, I got really excited because they remind me of Heidi Swap. So I bought this one for that purpose. Oh, and here are the picks. Here are the little dinosaur picks that go with the wrap. See, I knew I bought the little picks. Because we'll do cupcakes and we'll just do the little dinosaur, you know, cupcake thing. Then I saw this one and I thought the same thing. Look how cute that is. And these are made out of like a cardboard. So um, they're going to hold up well with pictures and layering and what have you. You can make a shabby chic book out of this. Add not only pictures, but you can add mementos. You can add lace, different types of lace and ribbons. Um, that's what I thought immediately for this one for $1.25. Hello. Yeah. That's what I thought of. Then I will be doing a, um, a video. This one says thank you tags. Again, this came from the, what? Yeah, the wedding department. And I was really looking for the round one. They didn't have the round one still. This is the only one that they had. But when I saw this, I was like, I wonder if I can make a miniature dollhouse. Because it looks like the side of a dollhouse. Just do the little center part. And then do the other end. And it'll look like a little miniature dollhouse. For my dollhouse. Okay, so that's going to that's gonna be one of my personal projects I'm going to be doing. Okay. Okay. All right, then I saw Miniatures Cooking and More. Okay, I do promote her channel on my community, my community um, page tab. And um, she shared how she used these in one of her projects to make it look like a sink. Um, you know, like the faucet. And she used larger ones, but I wanted to get these smaller ones. So if I wanted to dip my toe and make them look like faucets, see what I'm saying? It looks like a faucet. And I want to create my own bathroom. I can do it. So I, I found those in that smaller size. Then I saw this was new. And this is by Tool Bench. Go ahead. This is a removable picture strip. Okay, four pairs holds up to five pounds. Never seen that before. I'm not too sure if this works or not, but we're going to find out. We're going to find out. Oh, and then I did find this one, and this is 30 feet, and this is, a, this is part of their uh, floral gardens, and it looks like silver, like a leather silver, and I was like, ooh, that's cool. I'm sure I can, you know, use this for something cool, right? So I went on ahead and got it. Then um, I did get some plastic spoons, you know, just to make my life a little easy over here. And then um, I already shared that one with you. Then I did get this little, this little, it's called Sticky Notes Memo Set. And then you find them and they're like this. They're like flat. And they have two different designs. They're by Jot. And this is the outside of the one that I picked. This is the one I wanted. 
because we're going to be doing a lot of reading and I wanted to use these to hold the pages and make notes, especially for recipes and stuff. Um, so it's like multi-purpose because they're sticky notes and they're cute. So, but they close up like that. Okay. Yeah. So I got this design, but they did have like two designs. Then this are the stickers, the only sticker that I bought. I think it's the only sticker. Yeah. It's the only sticker that I bought and it had this great seashell theme as you could tell. So it's summertime. We're planning to go to the beach um, as soon as my leg heals a little bit more so I, you know, I can get on the beach. And there you go. Now, they finally brought back the placards, kids, um, kids, uh, you know, tooth, tooth um, cleaners. And this is a pack of 40. I haven't seen these in a very, very, very long time. So I went on ahead and got two packs of these because my kids do take care of their oral hygiene. I picked up that cute little tin with the lock and key. Money can't buy me love. So I thought that that was kind of cute. So I went on ahead and I got that. Then I did, I am missing a bag because I did buy two different kinds of these. These are cold packs. So when my kids have boo-boos that get hurt or if even if I have a migraine and it just hurts like right here, I could just take this out from the fridge and just uh, lay it on my head and it'll give me some relief. So I did get the little froggy and I did get the football. So it's, it's definitely in the other bag. Then for my kiddos, I found these cool dangers of the deep and these are tattoos and these are made in the USA. Okay. And they have some really cool tattoos, 25 of them. So I knew they would like that. Then I also picked up from the children's department. They came back out with all the little wooden kits. So I did get one of the bird feeders so they can put that together. And what I wanted to know is these little wooden kits by Creative Hands, they actually look like this. Like the pieces are already painted. When you put them together, they really and truly look like that. So I got these and I was thinking, I wonder if I can incorporate some of these pieces in my dollhouse miniatures like in a boy room. I don't know. And then they had that one that looks like that. That's like super cool. Then they had this unicorn one. And they had the mushroom, little mushroom, um, little mushroom house. And they're all by Creative Kids, okay? And like I said, they actually look like this. They actually look like, you don't have to paint them, they look like that. Which is a really cool thing to have, especially if you want to be a little creative and use them for different, for different things. Then I did get some more Play-Doh because they really like these. And that's just a great one to have. So that's, I, oh no, it's not everything. Like I almost forgot. They do have these great new plate sets. I almost forgot this plate set. Now they had it in the blue and then they have it in this really pretty, I don't, I don't know if you call, consider this gray, but they have the cups. They have, um, look how pretty the cup is. Very elegant looking for a plastic piece. And then they have the really pretty plate that also had it in blue. Um, but I just thought there was something kind of farmhouse, rustic that would go well here. I only got one and one cup to share with you guys. But I thought that this would work well with a farmhouse, rustic type of look because of the color. Yeah. So there you have it. Now that, that's actually everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this share and I'm going to talk to you all later. Bye.